great. <laughs> no one's driving that again. Ah, oh, crap. Hey, get away from the car. Come Back get me. Out time. You got some kind of death wish? Molotov and let's see some flames. Yeah, he got that nice and good. Love the smell of burning paintwork. Whole block her dead. We gotta go. We can take Dino's car. How'd you know this is Dino's car? I don't like you, and you got a good car? I'm gonna know where you Reports of burning vehicles and ghost fire in North Park. It. It's right near Morello's place. Don't bring in the wrong people. Old ways are the best ways. Straight through the gate! We gotta get out of here before the bulls show! There Don't let him get away! Drive! Come on, <laughs> Ah, oh, shit. We got cops. So, uh, what do we do? We lose them by driving real fast and getting clear of them. Sounds good. Right now they're pissed. But let's not get them real pissed. Okay, we lost them. Stay out of sight till they lose interest. Drive careful, Tom. You don't need more heat. He's gone. Go back to patrols. We'll We're good. Time. Let's head back and see the boss. I thought Silieri had cops on the books. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. How did it feel? Feel good? Like what feel? Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it did. No time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. You think it's for you? This life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beat motors in parking lots. Eh. There's busy days, there's slow days. I've had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, stole enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, knew never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by and I'm still there. So... I got a soup now, and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I always thought that to be in a family you had to have more connections. Your brother, or your uncle, or... Oh, some guys, sure. Their cousin got made, or you like Carlo, who's popping way back with the Don. That means you get trusted more when you're starting out. But there's plenty of us who came in off the street. I'm thinking we get you in front of the boss, then we tip a few. Well, I don't got plans, so... Sure you don't got plans. The plans are to feed Vinny so much booze that Luigi has to roll him out the door again. I'm good with whatever. <laughs> sure you are.
yourself into the car I sent you out with. Dumped it. Well, why? It was a boiler. This one's better. A b -b better car with a b -b broken window? Russia ain't never killed nobody. He's still with you then. Somehow, yeah. Hey boss, it's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good, sit down. You see Morello? Nah, but he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not gonna be able to think straight for weeks. See, that's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morella is a hothead, and all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. You got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands, make sure the bills get paid on time. You up for that? Oh, it'd be an honor, sir. Good. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you, but you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. Second, we don't deal in the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Salieri. Then I'm gonna only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. A lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys in this room, they're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? They're loyal. That's right. Now you stay straight with me, you're gonna be living the high life, Tom. But you abuse my trust. <sighs> Don Salieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. Okay then. Welcome to the family. Excellent. Now I'm starving. Luigi, let's see. Welcome. A barman Luigi is not much of a cook, but his daughter Sarah, Maron. Those first days in Celieri's bar were slow. I moved crates and delivered messages. The guys busted balls and told stories from the old country. Mostly, we just waited. I got to thinking, maybe life in Celieri's crew wasn't gonna get me clipped. Come on, <laughs> but I got what did I know? Finish it all. You, Tommy? Come on, there's yeah. still gas in your tank. Boss get is waiting back. for you. Thanks. Ignora quel idiota. Arrenditi. Ah, potrai combattere ancora. There he is. Sorry I'm late. Take a seat. That's collection day, boys. So Tommy, you'll drive? 
Paulie and Sam can handle the rest. It'll be routine. Just a handful of stops today. Bill at the motel was a little short last month. So make sure he pays us the interest he owes. No problem, boss. Don't lay hands on anyone unless there's no other choice. Our clients need to understand that we provide a valuable service. They need to look at you and see Santa Michael. They need to believe they'll protect them. So let Morella stoop to breaking legs. We're better than that. But the bills still do, and everyone pays up. We can handle it. Go see Ralphie about a car. Okay, boss. Now, Vinny said to say he's got something for you, Tom. Head to him first. Probably just wants to tell you some bullshit story about some guy he whacked 20 years ago. You guys need to be careful today, okay? I spoke to Biff. He said Morello's still bent since he lost the cars. Ah, what's losing some motors to him? He's got at least five garages this side of town. He's not wrong, Paul. You guys know it like I know. It's always the same. Bello does this, so Salieri does that. Some cars here, some booze there. Just calm down for a few weeks, then it all happens again. World keeps turning. Well, it's been a month. A month's made of weeks. Quit whining. Hey, just the guy. I saw this, and I thought of you. You ever carried a rat? Shot him at the fair a couple of times. <laughs> right, that don't count. Pointed at the target over there. Good posture, bang. Brain all off the walls, okay? Now show me a reload. I right, open the chamber and away you go. All right, last thing needs to be hidden. Stick it in your belt. Good to go. And when shooting starts, get behind some and don't shit yourself. Thanks, Vincenzo. I appreciate it. Hey, the Frank and the boss is Vincenzo. To you, it's Finney. You know how to g g get into one of these, Tommy? Elbow goes through. Reach inside. Easy. And then afternoon to f f f fix the window back up. Watch. And... Learn. You're a regular magician, Ralphie. To Tommy, show me what you can do. Okay, it's c, c car. You got it. Have a good day, for the fellas. First, we got Al. He runs a bakery on Longman Street. You know it? Yeah, I know it. Al's late again. Seems so. Eh, that's too bad.
Okay, this is it. Watch what we do today, Tom. When it goes smooth, it's a breeze. When they put up a fight, sometimes you gotta think on your feet. Sure. Just follow my lead. Sam, Polly, how are you? We're good. How's little Julia? Ha! Not so little now. She's turning into a pain in the ass, just like her grandma. <laughs> That's good to hear, Al. 